Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com, with four-time Mr. Olympia, Jay Cutler at BPI, headquarters in sunny, beautiful Florida. And we're being real here, we've got weights being thrown around, you can hear that. But speaking of weights being thrown around, let's talk about something that I remember the first time I saw Jay, it's actually when, uh, I, arguably, you should have won Mr. Olympia the first time. And I remember you coming on stage and you shook your leg and the thing kept moving and then you tightened it. And I remember seeing these big tree trunks. I'm like, holy crap, I was actually at Weeder at the time, so I actually had good seats. And um, what I want to know, this is the last day of the split. One, why the hell are we putting it last? Two is leg day. What are your favorite lifts and why only once a week? Most dreaded body part to train. Unless you're a masochist, I'll tell you that. We can, we can skip. We can skip the training today and do some legs if you want. I, I'm here tomorrow. <laughs> I need a day to prep for that. So uh, to touch on legs, I mean, obviously it's a genetic body part for me. I mean, I've been fortunate enough to develop a great leg development and a lot of cross striations intact. So uh, for me, end of the week, it's I save it for the last. Obviously, I go through all the training. I like to incorporate it on the day off, so it's the last uh, training day of the week, usually of the split. And uh, I focus on, you know, quad hamstring training together, uh, get that pump through the whole leg. Uh, for me, the staple of my movements, obviously the core movement, the squat. So you still squat? Still squat. Back squats or front squats. I like to alternate week to week. Heavy? Uh, uh, you know what? I still focus. Everything's 8 to, eight to 12 repetitions. so. I mean, I go up to maybe 400 pounds, but remember, it's all about reps. It's not about, I used to be a 700 pound squatter when I was 20 years old, and I attribute a lot of my leg size to really heavy, heavy weights. Uh, obviously, you're walking on your legs all day, so you, you have to do something that's gonna stimulate them different. And a lot of times, repetitions aren't necessarily the things to do. I mean, a lot of guys go to 20 reps. I've always had great results from doing 12 maximum repetitions on legs. So I always start off with, with extension. I like to pre-exhaust, so I'll do extension movement, just to warm up, not necessarily working sets. I'll do two or three sets, really warm the knees, and then I'll move into it. Usually, I like a leg press, something to really get the blood going in there, get some, some good, uh, uh, you know, something mental to be able to go, oh, okay, I'm training legs, and I, I got a good pump going, and then I move into squats secondary, okay? So warm up with extensions, leg press, and then a squat. So that's it. Well, thanks so much for your time. Thanks for watching, guys. We appreciate it. Once again, BPI, I'm going to link it down below where to buy their stuff. And more videos coming up on the products and everything else. Thanks for watching. And remember, since the last video, I'm going to say it. It's not a game.